Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Let's see what message wants to show through for you today Gemini. And of course these are general collective readings, will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind, take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers, thank you, thank you for being here. And Gemini, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us. We welcome you in. All right, gems. Oh, Queen of Pentacles in reverse, Ten of Wands in reverse and the Fool card in reverse. But then there's a Page of Wands upright and the Six of Cups, center of my spread, Gemini. Somebody wants to come back and do the right thing. It seems you're going to be getting a message soon. Okay, so Queen of Swords, Five of Pentacles in reverse and the Hanged Man in reverse. And the Magician, bottom of my deck. Well, somebody is manifesting a comeback here, uh, Gems. Uh, it seems, from what this is my first feeling when I'm seeing these cards, somebody was not given the respect they should have in the connection. Maybe that offer was not given. Somebody got played the fool and they decided, hey, I'm not going to mess with them anymore i'm going to drop this baggage i don't want it anymore i'm you know my person well they just didn't treat me right but i do feel somebody wants to come back now there's a message coming of somebody saying hey i want to return i want to do the right thing but whoever was a disrespected party here gemini they become very strong now i don't think they're going to well um, allow this person back in just like that with open arms Let's see what's going to happen. All right, so James, I'm going to start with some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, right? What that would be first and then we'll do the clarification. So Gemini and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Gemini and their person. Gemini and their person. Thank you. I'm going to take a few more gems from another deck. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there, Gems. Gemini and that person. Thank you. And a couple more from a third deck, Gemini. And then we begin. Gemini and that person. Okay. Good to go, Gems. Let's start your reading. The first card here says... I'm haunted by your presence. I see you in my dreams. I hear you telepathically. Every song I hear reminds me of you. I see your name everywhere and numbers that have special meaning to us. Everything reminds me of you and all I want is you. If this is happening to you, why do you stay at a distance? There is no escape for me when I try and move on. I'm haunted even more. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. Second card says, I feel your energy and receive your telepathy. Okay, so a lot of telepathic communication going on. Second card with the same reference. I feel your energy and receive your telepathy. I reach out and show how much I care and offer you support. You read my messages. Just give me a second, James. I need a sip of water. Yeah, sorry. So maybe communication is a bit strained here. I had something stuck in my throat. I could barely get my words out. So, well, somebody says here, I feel your energy and receive your telepathy. I reach out and show you how much I care and offer you support. You read my messages and I feel you even more. But then you stay silent. Your telepathy is a contradiction to the silence. I just can't simply understand this. If you love me, let me know and let it show. If you don't love me, please set me free and let me go. I showed you how much I loved you through our kisses. They say if you want to know if someone loves you, it's in their kiss. Darling, my love for you was in my kiss. I can't ever kiss another like that. The thought of ki you kissing someone else breaks my heart. So these were unspoken things going on, telepathic messages, maybe kisses, I don't know, but um, maybe it's never been said openly that I love you, you love me, we are together, but um, well, so that's why I said strange communication. 
You're never done because I'm your shadow. When you cry, I'll embrace you in spirit. When you're sad, I'll help remind you to smile. I'm always there for you, even when you don't see me. Not talking to you absolutely breaks my heart and soul into a billion shattered pieces. I want to reach out to you, but I can't find the right words as I'm feeling so fragile right now. Again, reference on communication. I hunger for your touch, your kiss and the warmth of your body. I want and I need you now. I have an addiction. My feelings for you are now platonic. And this is this could be the Queen of Swords saying that, hey, listen, I can be friends with you, but don't expect the kisses now because of the way you've behaved with me, right? Let's talk and clear the air. Well, somebody does want to talk still. They want to come back. They want to do the right thing. So let's see what's going to happen. Okay, Gemini. Uh, let's take an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you. Then we'll start with the reading. So my angels, what do you have for my precious gems? Blessing, guidance, advice, or a message. Oops. Steady progress, Gemini, is the card that you get. Well, it may be somebody needs to put in consistent work now because I think the trust is lost here. From what I'm feeling, this Queen of Swords absolutely has no trust left. But somebody does want to come out of the cold and, uh, well, they need to put in some constant, consistent, what does it say, steady progress. Okay, so that's all I have for you, for my angels. And now we get on to our reading. So, Queen of Pentacles, what happened here, Spirit? Why is the Queen of Pentacles in reverse? This Queen of Pentacles felt that my person is just not uh, maybe giving that offer of a happily ever after, no, no emotional happiness, no promise for the future. And uh, maybe this person got a little, felt a bit disrespected that they were taken for granted, uh, even though the wish was there to maybe that feeling was there that we could have had something together but since this queen of pentacles is in reverse i'm assuming that they were not given the offer or they felt they disrespected or they came to the conclusion that this is not going to go far uh, this queen of pentacles has been healing from what i'm feeling because they decided hey i'm not going to carry the baggage all by myself i'm i'm the only one carrying all that weight of the connection my back gets tired right i wanted my person to share you know, half the load so we could have this ten of, uh, ten of Cups together. So, three of one, sorry, Ten of Wands in reverse spirit. Ten of Wands, what happened here? What's this Ten of Wands? Yeah, somebody got unstuck, they stagnated, finished this connection and said, I'm not going to work on this anymore. I'm going to spend my time healing myself from the heartbreak that's been caused. I think somebody did have that hope that they did see this connection going the long haul, but since it hasn't, uh, one person has been healing and uh, doing so by not s saying, I'm done. I'm going to get unstuck from a situation of maybe waiting around for the other person. So there's been some stagnancy, uh, Gemini, in this connection. Uh, what's the full card spirit in reverse? Why is the full card in reverse? Full card in reverse. One more. Okay, one more. Yeah. Yeah, somebody feels somebody feels the person made very unwise and foolish choices here in this connection. Maybe that's how the Queen of Pentacles is feeling. I think that their person was a little pompous. Maybe they always wanted their way or they just, there were mind games or power struggles. And I do see three people in this card. Maybe one person was trying to always have the power to say, you know, I'm going to do what I want and I'm the boss and just, just maybe stubborn behavior I would say I think this queen of pentacles is the one who decided I'm not going to be juggled I don't like this imbalance that is in this connection I'm going to drop this uh, connection altogether if you're not going to put the work in well I'm going to heal myself and I'm going to focus on my own life and uh, well let's call it quits or 
maybe you just have a platonic connection now give me one more spirit for the fall in reverse yeah this queen of pentacles could have stopped fighting for this connection i was just trying to uh, reaffirm what i felt so now spirit what's this page of wands page of wands page of wands okay so somebody is not happy now somebody is not happy uh, maybe they thought it would be nicer if they had lots of options or kept their options open but now since their uh, queen of pentacles has dropped them or is looking like they're in not interested now whoever the other person was now they're not happy at all they're not happy they are feeling totally confused now they're realizing oh i need to heal this connection this is uh, kind of got gotten out of hand my person has totally given up on this connection i have a feeling they want to now well maybe send a message or start something new basically their main focus is how do i come back now okay so somebody wants to now come back so what's the spirit six of cups six of cups oops 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 sorry six of cups yeah they want to come back because they're feeling the loss of love and now the ten ones are on the other side the ten ones are now on the other side because they're realizing hey i've lost such a big cup of love now they're realizing this was probably a spiritual connection i felt such a, a strong bond with them we, you know we were so compatible they seemed like a very soulful past life kind of connection now the stress and tension is oh my god have i lost this connection altogether where's the love gone now somebody wants to now end the conflict and say hey can we now move on can we start again can i come back can we find that peace and harmony once again so justice spirit or the justice card justice they're not too sure whether yeah they're not too sure that they will be forgiven they do want to try again they want to come back as an emperor now they want to try again but they're not too sure i'll tell you why because i think in the past this person has behaved in a very very immature manner maybe they were behaving like a player maybe they were you know being very inconsistent uh, not committing or maybe just flirting around with other people so they feel well i'm going to be judged now so they're not feeling very secure at this point but they definitely want to try again this person wants to now come back as an emperor i'm ready to do the right thing now i'm ready to take uh, responsibility of the connection but uh, there is a bit of scare why because now they know that the queen of pentacles has now become the queen of swords it's not going to be an easy ride it's not going to be an easy ride to come back into the queen of swords energy because the queen of swords has become very very strong they know that uh, the queen of swords will not hesitate if they come come in wrong they just going to be cut off why because the queen of pentacles has now become the empress the empress never chases this empress embodies all the four queens right so well to deal with an empress you have to come in as an emperor and <clears throat> i think this person has now recognized that my queen this queen is not just a queen this is i'm dealing with an empress and the only right thing to do is if i have to try again if i have to i have to a put in steady progress steady work in this connection and i have to match them where they are and they see their person now as an empress so they now need to come back as an emperor to match this empress okay the main goal right now is to come out of the cold with this empress i feel uh five of pentacles in reverse spirit five of pentacles in reverse five of pentacles in reverse five of pentacles in reverse yes they are seeing their person this empress as uh, well the best thing i think since sliced bread they're seeing this empress glowing they're seeing them as single they're seeing them as independent they're seeing them as 
having everything they need they seeing that uh, you know this empress is behaving like hey my feelings for you are now platonic i wanted you but i don't really need you and the more they are, this person is seeing it the more foolish they feel they 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 feel about themselves because now they don't know what to say they want to send in that message they don't know how how to say it they don't know how now to bring in that apology which they know they must uh, take to this empress uh, somebody is feeling very discontent feeling very bored now none of, none of the other options are looking as good all their mind games that they were playing with this empress i don't think this uh, this a uh, person recognized their person to be that empress maybe in the past they just saw them as a queen of pentacles and they said all right you know i'll you know i'll have the last laugh and i can treat them the way i want to now now somebody is rec- seeing the truth about what they lost somebody lost an empress here so what's the hangman in reverse spirit hangman in reverse hangman in reverse yes now they are uh, now they want to get unstuck this person is desperately desperately wanting to come out of this stuck place with this empress they feeling very very insecure very ungrounded they just don't know what to do heart of hearts i think all this person was wants is to find victory once again with this same empress they want to request hey can we begin again can we have a restart okay so spirit uh, what's this magician what's the magician uh, who's manifesting what here why is this an overall energy of gemini is reading today magician ah uh-huh. okay okay so listen now what's happening is they're seeing this empress empress become the magician now the more they are seeing this person is spying big time whoever this king of pentacles in reverse or the king of uh, knight of uh, wands is this person has been spying all along now they are recognizing that my empress is a magician I mean they're going to cut me off they're going to see right through me because of all the bad memories now that have been created in this connection mm, they don't see this empress really feeling really bad about this lost connection in fact the more they are spying the more they are looking at this empress maybe spying through social media or maybe the little conversations you guys have they're seeing this empress really in a happy place they feel this empress is glowing they're looking very happy and uh, maybe turning their back towards them and checking out their other options and the more they see this empress in magician mode having all the tools available to them to have the happiest life possible the more this person is getting stressed out okay so yes uh, they do want to return may maybe they will be sending a message anything else for it for um, gemini anything else for gemini any last words here one more yes if some somewhere there is a fear if somewhere there is a fear that this uh, empress doesn't love them anymore this empress has gone silent on them knows too much about them and will not agree now to having the long term partnership with them so somebody is really really stressed out um they took this person for granted not recognizing that they were dealing with an empress now they want to come back as an emperor but it's going to take a lot of work that's all i can say a lot of steady progress has to be put into this connection maybe maybe not this empress will allow them back in so that's all i have for you chemini till next time then love and light take care namaste